Kia ora from New Zealand, everyone. I'm Donna Louise, and welcome to my YouTube channel for the love of puzzles. A few weeks ago, I showed you this jigsaw puzzle in a puzzle haul, and I explained to you that I was going to use it to help campaign for the Bird of the Year, which is a yearly competition here in New Zealand. Forest and Bird, also known by their formal name of Royal Forest and Bird Protection Society of New Zealand, is an environmental organization specializing in the protection and conservation of New Zealand's indigenous flora and fauna and unique wild places and natural ecosystems. Bird of the Year was created by the late Helen Bain, who was Forest and Bird's communication manager. The yearly vote started in October 2005 and continues today and is very, very popular. Now, this year is extra exciting because Forest and Bird turns 100 years old. So they've renamed the competition from Bird of the Year to Bird of the Century. And I was asked to help promote the campaign for the Eastern Rockhopper Penguin. Now, sadly, its conservation status is in serious trouble. So I said, yes, I would help campaign for the Eastern Rockhopper Penguin. And what better way to do so than with the jigsaw puzzle? We take the Bird of the Year competition very seriously here in New Zealand and people campaign for their favorite bird and get behind it, but sometimes they go to extremes and there's been some voting fraud and other scandals over the years. Let me list you a few. In 2008, the successful campaign for the Kakapo was accused by the Takahe of accepting undeclared donations from, in quotes, wealthy migratory birds from Monaco. Well. It was cleared, though, by the fictional Serious Feathered Fraught Office, and the Kakapo remained victorious that year. In 2017, the competition suffered another scandal when 112 fraudulent votes were made for the white face heron using internet bots from an IP address found in Christchurch. In 2021, the long-tailed bat was added to the competition with mixed opinions by voters and candidates alike because the bat's not a bird. Well, the controversial entry ended up winning the 2021 New Zealand Bird of the Year. So let's keep this year's competition clean, folks, and please put your support behind the Eastern Rockhopper Penguin with your vote. The jigsaw puzzle in question is from the New Zealand brand Holtzen. It's just 300 pieces, extra large pieces, so they're nice and bigger. This is from their Treasures of Aotearoa series. Aotearoa is the Te Reo Māori name for New Zealand. Now, there were four different puzzles in this collection, one depicting an albatross, kia, pukeko, and this one that I have is called Penguin Pride. The artist is Ned Barrow. Now, I don't actually know if the depiction is of an eastern rockhopper penguin, but it is of crested penguins, and the eastern rockhopper penguin is a crested penguin, so it's the closest that I could find. During the time lapse, I thought I'd share with you some information about the Eastern Rockhopper Penguin, and then I'll leave all the information in the description below on how you can go vote. Voting opens October 30th and runs for two weeks, and thank you so much for your support. For the love of puzzles, let's just jump right in. The oldest known penguin fossils are found here in New Zealand. They are approximately 60 million years old and from a time when the continents were differently arranged and the southern hemisphere was up to 8 degrees Celsius warmer than it is today. The eastern rockhopper penguin is approximately 55 centimeters tall, weighs about 2.5 kilograms, has a black brush up with handsome yellow crests, an orange beak, pink feet, and red eyes. They make their homes across a far-flung range of rocky, wind-swept islands along the northern limits of the Antarctic Circumpolar Current, from Campbell Island, south of New Zealand, to the Prince Edward Islands, southeast of South Africa. To hunt, they head south into cooler waters, south of the polar front, on their month-long journeys. They find their prey, mostly subantarctic krill, at depths between 30 and 60 meters, but are known to dive deeper than 100 meters. They mate for life, but spend 75% of the year apart. When they return to their home colony to mate, rockhopper parents follow strict roles. During the first three to four weeks of chick rearing, males stay at the nest, fasting while females hunt and provision the chick. In the remaining five to six weeks, 
chicks group together in creches while both parents forage. Climate change impacts on prey mean longer foraging trips and less frequent food for the chick. Males are more likely to take longer trips and prioritize their own meals, making the chick rearing strategy poorly adapted to a changing climate. Penguins are the second most threatened bird group in the world. Here in New Zealand, our shores provide shelter to more penguin species than anywhere else on Earth, more even than Antarctica. All of New Zealand's penguins are in trouble. The population of eastern rockhopper penguins, who once ruled the cliffs of the sub-Antarctic islands, is crashing. On Campbell Island, a former stronghold, nesting pairs have declined 95% from the 1940s to now from 800,000 to just 51,500 pairs. Our oceans are warming and prey species like krill and squid are getting harder to find. Protecting these unique New Zealand species requires conservation action on land and at sea. Well, I hope you enjoyed this little jigsaw puzzle and learning about the Eastern rockhopper penguin. If you have the time, I really appreciate it. If you would go vote, I'll leave all the information in the description below. I believe it only takes a minute or two to do so. Thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. For the love of puzzles, I hope you enjoy my videos. Please consider subscribing. And until next time, ciao. He's a cutie.